On Saturday, December 4th, the Greater Little Rock chapter of Jack and Jill of America hosted its annual Breakfast with Santa event on the campus of the Dr. Martin Luther King Elementary School near downtown Little Rock. The organization provided a healthy breakfast box for over 300 families who were in attendance, according to the foundation's president, Stephanie Walker Hines. We caught up with a few of the Jack and Jill moms, as well as the Jack and Jill dads, to find out a little bit more about the event and the importance of being involved in the community. Jack Jill, the Greater Little Rock chapter, is always excited to host this event simply because we realize that there are some children who may not necessarily get a gift for Christmas, but most importantly, we're able to provide a free, healthy meal. Um, and they get an opportunity to see Santa, a black Santa, which there's always a kid every year that says, oh wow, I didn't know Santa was black. And so it's important for them to be able to see someone that looks like them and identify with getting that gift and feeling special at this time of year. So we're always excited to be able to provide that back to them. I am Cassandra Steele. I am the last charter member of the Greater Little Rock chapter of Jack and Jill, and I will be graduating out officially this year. But we're here at Breakfast with Santa. Breakfast with Santa is a, um, an initiative of our foundation. Um, it is something that the chapter started way over 10 years ago, probably more around 15 years ago, where we bring um, an opportunity for children to have an experience with an African-American Santa and Mrs. Claus. Um, the funds, are, it is a fundraiser for Greater Little Rock Chapter, and the funds go to the National Jack and Jill Foundation, or a part of the funds go to our foundation, our national foundation. We get to keep a third here in our community to, um, to help, you know, um, in our community, a third goes to the foundation and a third uh, to our chapter. So we are um, in the process of finishing up here today. Um, let me tell you a little bit about Jack and Jill. Jack and Jill of America has over 40,000 members and about 252 chapters nationwide and beyond. Um, we're just so happy to have the community support with our um, Breakfast with Santa. Breakfast with Santa has one consistent, well two consistent sponsors, Arkansas Commitment, who they do a wonderful job of providing gifts for the children. And then 100 black men who have been with us since the very beginning, helping to provide breakfast um, for the children who come through. And um, we're just so excited to have them. We had um, a new sponsor this year, I believe it was one of the nursing organizations. But um, as you can see, we because of COVID, we had to switch to a driveway. We did this last year. And it's actually been really wonderful having the kids come through. And every child that participates in Breakfast with Santa gets a healthy breakfast, a toy, an age appropriate toy, and a book because we do want to promote uh, literacy as well. Teen volunteers are a large part of the success of the event each year and we caught up with Jack and Jill's team president to get her thoughts. My name is Carrington Johnson and I'm the team president of the Greater Little Rock chapter of Jack and Jill of America. And I'm here today to talk about why it is important for me as a team to be involved in my community. For example, with this event we have today, Breakfast with Santa, it is very important that teens be involved with their community and see how much giving back can really affect people in their community, like their friends, their brothers, their sisters, their cousins. They're all coming here to come see us. And by people donating presents and donating food, you're helping your community be better. You're helping your friends be better. You're helping everybody be better. And it just makes a better turnout every single year because everybody needs help, so everybody's gonna get help. And it's good to show teens that. Dads are just as important to help make sure the event is successful every year. And we caught up with one of them to get his thoughts about today. It is important for dads to be involved in the Jack and Jill. Even though Jack and Jill is known as a, a women-driven organization, it's always important for men to be involved in the community. First and foremost, we need to support what our moms are doing. And secondly, it's important because our teens, our kids, our teens need to see us being involved and us taking an active role in our community. And so Jack and Jill, this organization is a great organization to get your kids involved, get them exposed, 
but more importantly, okay. it's for mom and dads to come together to ensure that our kids are being exposed to the right things in our community, and number two, that we are being active in our community. Jack and Jill is thankful for their sponsors. We learned why one of them, the 100 black men of Greater Little Rock, is involved every year. My name is Wendell Scales, and I'm the vice president of the 100 black men of Greater Little Rock. Um, today, December the 4th, we're here with uh, Jack and Jill of Greater Little Rock at Martin Luther King Elementary, supporting families, serving breakfast, uh, preparing gifts for the less fortunate. Um, it's very important every holiday to make sure everybody does their part. And uh, with our motto is, what you see is what you'll be. Uh, we want to make sure we're creating an opportunity for our community leaders, for our young people, our, our young men and women, um, to have models, um, to understand what civic engagement and service really means. Um, it's, it's just a small part of us being able to show them that giving time is the most important piece of making sure our communities continue to thrive. For the kiddos, just as important as receiving a healthy breakfast was the chance to see Santa and tell him everything on their Christmas list this year. Santa and Mrs. Claus love seeing and hearing from the kids every year. We found out why. I love to see their smiles on their faces and I love to see it when they're excited to tell Santa what they want and so it's just wonderful to have the spirit of Christmas here with everything and the gifting that's giving from the community. It's just wonderful. Jack and Jill organization is amazing. And for me, it is it's, it is all about the kids. It's all about the smiles and the joy that uh, they get when they see us or are able to get out the car and just tell me what they want for Christmas. So I appreciate Jack and Jill inviting us down from the North Pole uh, so we can enjoy the kids because that's what we love to do.